Hi, this is Tim from Imagitronics.org and today we're going to take a look at my modification to this RC Moon phase light. Okay, let's take a quick look at how our modified moon actually works. Um, here we're at Stardate.org, we're using their lunar calendar and we're using our very simple lunar update application which is written in C Sharp and essentially all it does is sends the current system time and date to the Arduino via serial. The Arduino in turn updates the real-time clock module. So all we need to do to change the setting is to change our system date. So let's say we want to see a nice third quarter moon. We have a third quarter moon on June 15th. So we set our system time to June 15th. And then we simply update. Now there's a small update delay that's built into the, to the lunar update application because some models of Arduino require a few seconds to reboot. Uh, some models of Arduino do not require that. So it says we're done updating the clock. So if we remove it from its light source, you'll see we have a nice third quarter moon. So let's try another one. Let's go ahead and take a look at a nice full moon. Let's set our date to June 9th. We set the system date to June 9th. Oh, you know what? Let's give it a nice ending of the moon down here. We'll put it on uh, the 26th, where we should only see a sliver on the right side of the moon. So here we go. We're going to go ahead and update it. As I said, we have this artificial delay built into the code just because some Arduinos require it. And then once it's done updating the clock, if we remove it from its light source, you can see we have a very nice sliver of the moon that's lit over here. And that's pretty much how it works. And that's really all there is to it. I hope you'll take the time to look at the code and see if you can come up with your own great ideas for modding toys.